Hi everyone, welcome to the Droid G channel. Today's video will explain to you how to unlock Android phone without password. How to unlock Android mobile without password. When you forget your password, it is difficult for an Android phone to enter the lock screen without knowing the password. Many Android users have encountered this problem, and you may wonder how to unlock an Android phone without a passcode. You can use several methods in this video to guide you how to unlock your phone when you forget your password. The mobile phone models applicable to this video include Samsung, Huawei, Xiaomi, One Pulse, Vivo, Oppo, Sony, LG, HTC. Please be patient to finish watching this video. I believe it will solve the problem of how to unlock the phone without a password for you. In order to protect important data and private information on our mobile phones, we will choose to set a lock screen password or fingerprint lock on our Android phones to prevent others from entering and spying on our mobile phone content. But unfortunately, you now forget the unlock code and fingerprint lock. You've tried all the codes you can remember, but they still haven't unlocked it. Now your Android phone is locked and you will not be able to access all the files on it. So you may ask how to unlock Android phone without passcode? Whether you've forgotten your passcode, or bought a second-hand phone that arrived locked from the previous user, being locked out of your own phone can be an unsettling experience. Of course, the latter situation does not include the situation that the previous user has cleared the password. I just changed the unlocked password of the Android phone and forgot the password, resulting in the lock of the Android phone. It is also possible that the child repeatedly tries to use the wrong password to unlock your Android phone, or the phone is accidentally touched in the pocket and the password is entered incorrectly many times, resulting in your Android phone needing to be locked for a day or even longer before being provided to you. Your next chance to enter your password. These are some possible reasons why you want to unlock your Android phone without entering the password. Can an Android phone be unlocked without a password? If you also have such doubts, what I can tell you accurately is that there are some ways to bypass the Android lock screen to unlock without a password. If you're concerned about recovering your phone without the passcode, you should make sure your phone stays signed into your Google or Samsung account. This will allow you to unlock your phone from another Android device or computer. Keep in mind that different phone manufacturers have different complementary ways to unlock your phone. Let's take a look at the various ways to unlock an Android phone without a passcode. If you think this video is good, you can subscribe, like or leave a message to tell us which method helped you solve the problem. Method 1 is to use your fingerprint to unlock or face recognition to unlock the phone without a password. How to unlock Android phone without password without losing data. How to enter your Android phone to use normally when you forget Android phone password. Two features on modern Android phones are fingerprint unlock and face recognition unlock. At this point you can use one of these two methods to unlock your Android phone. This is probably the first method that comes to mind, it's simple and very efficient. When you need to use your fingerprint to unlock or face recognition to unlock your phone without a password, your Android phone must have one of them set before forgetting the password. My Samsung phone is unlocked with fingerprints. Now, you need to wait for the lock countdown to end. Turn on the phone after the end, the fingerprint unlock position will be displayed on the phone screen. You only need to place the phone you set fingerprint unlock on the Android phone screen unlock position, and your phone will be unlocked at this time go back to the main screen. If your mobile phone has a home button, in the same way, you can place your fingerprint unlocked mobile phone on the home button. Method 2 is to use the forgot password function to unlock the phone without a password. Note that it is only valid for Android 4.4 or lower. For Android 4.4 or lower versions, Android provides a forgotten pattern function. You can use the forgotten password function to unlock the phone without a password. Problems with forgot Android phone password phones in these versions can be unlocked using the forgot password feature. If your phone fails to unlock 5 times and you enter the wrong password again, you will be asked if you want to unlock with a security question or a backup PIN, which can also unlock your Android phone. Please click on forgot mode after which you will need to enter your Google account details. After completing the last step you will receive an email with information and a link on how to create a new password. Finally, save it, configure a new login, and use this new code to bypass Android pattern lock. After that, you will be able to use your phone normally. At this point, you can consider whether to reset the unlock password for your Android phone. Method 3 is to use smart lock to unlock your phone without a password. How do you access an Android phone that is locked without password? This may be the question that most users will think about after forgetting the Android password. There is a smart lock function on Android phones. If you have enabled smart lock on your phone before Android lock, you can use smart lock to unlock your phone without a password. Unlocking your Android phone with smart lock will be easy. Smart lock feature can unlock your Android phone without factory reset. Smart lock allows your phone to open without a passcode and the location it recognizes. The smart lock feature allows your phone to be unlocked and remain unlocked when in a trusted location connected to a trusted device, or used by a trusted person without requiring a passcode to unlock your Android phone. For example, 
If you've set up Smart Lock to use your home address as a trusted place, you can take your phone home and it will automatically unlock whenever you're near that address, no unlock code required. This is how you can easily bypass the Android lock screen. The following are the steps to set up the Smart Lock function. If you want to solve the problem quickly, please follow the steps below to set up. Please open the settings, find the lock screen in the settings interface, there is a Smart Lock option on the lock screen interface, please turn on the Smart Lock. You can choose from three options for Smart Lock. 1. On body detection, keeps your device unlocked while it is on your body, such as in your pocket or in your hand, but also works on other people. 2. Trusted places, add the locations that should unlock the device. 3. Trusted devices, add devices to keep them unlocked when nearby. All of these options will keep your Android unlocked at the specified location. We recommend that you try to use the second and third smart lock methods, which are more secure for your personal information. Method 4 is to use Samsung's Find My Phone service to unlock the phone without a password. How to unlock an Android phone without a password? You can unlock your phone without a passcode using Samsung's Find My Phone service. Samsung offers a feature for all phones that allows you to remotely manage your device if you lose it, including the Unlock Android Phone Passcode feature, which does. First, you need to log into your Samsung account on your mobile phone, and there must be a Wi-Fi or mobile data connection. After the mobile phone is connected to Wi-Fi or mobile data connection, please turn on your computer. Next, we need to use the computer to pass to reset your mobile phone password, please follow the steps below. 1. Open a search engine on your computer. Navigate to https colon slash slash findmymobile.samsung.com slash and log into your Samsung account on the web login page. After logging in, your device information will be displayed in the upper left corner of your computer screen. Please check whether your device information is correct on the computer. If it is not the Android phone you want to unlock, please find and select the Android phone you need to unlock in the upper left corner. The upper right corner is the function area, including lock, unlock, etc. Today we use the unlock function. 2. Please find and click the unlock icon in the function area. After clicking, a second confirmation pop-up box will appear. In the pop-up box, it will confirm with you twice whether you need to unlock your phone. Please click in the second pop-up box unlock. After clicking, please wait patiently for the computer and mobile phone to respond. At this time, you can pay attention to whether your mobile phone has bypassed the lock screen. 3. When done, all screen locks on your phone, including pattern locks, pins, passwords, and biometrics will be removed. The Android phone will automatically return to the main screen, please open your phone to check whether the phone is unlocked successfully. Method 5 is to use Google Find My Device to unlock the phone without a passcode. If all above methods still can't unlock your phone, you can use Google Account to bypass Android phone lock screen without password. Google has a free service called Find My Device, this service can unlock your Android phone without your password. You can use Google Find My Device to reset your Android phone. It formerly known as Android Device Manager. If you need to use Google Find My Device to solve the problem of forget password on Android phones, first, you need to use a computer to visit google.com slash android slash device manager. In Google Find My settings, you need to log into your Google account. Log into your Google account. Additionally, you will need to have your Android phone location turned on and connected to a data network or Wi-Fi. After the above steps are completed, please find and confirm your Android phone information on the computer screen. There will be three options on the left side of the computer screen, ring, lock, erase. The function we use today is the wipe function, which will completely clear the information on your Android phone. If there is necessary data in the Android phone, please back up the data before erasing the data. Next, please click erase device. After clicking, you will jump to the page and the login interface will appear. At this time, you need to log in your Google account again. Please enter your Google account and password and click confirm. After the login is complete, the page will jump back to the Google Find My Settings page again. Here, please click Erase Device again. You may need to wait patiently for a while to erase the device. While waiting to wipe, please note if your Android phone is preparing or undergoing a reset. After the reset is complete, your Android phone will display the same interface as when you first turned on the phone when you purchased it. After that, if you need to set a new Android lock screen password, please remember it firmly and write it down in a safe place to avoid the forgot Android phone passcode problem happening again. Method 6 is to restore the factory settings to unlock the phone without a password. It's also possible to unlock an Android phone without password by factory resetting your device. This is probably the last step you can do yourself. Restoring the factory settings can solve the problem of forgetting the password of the Android phone. If you need data on your phone, make sure you have backed up the data you need. Next, please follow the steps below to restore the phone to factory settings. Connect your phone to your computer. 
Then, make sure your phone is turned off and wait at least 30 seconds. Next, press the volume up button and the power button at the same time until you see the recovery mode screen. From the Android recovery screen, select wipe data slash factory reset using the volume buttons, and press the power button to confirm. Then, use the volume buttons to select factory reset and use the volume buttons to select the yes option to confirm. This will trigger the reset process, which should only take 2 to 3 seconds to complete. Once done, it will take you back to the same recovery mode. Use the power button to select the reboot system now option. Finally, your phone will turn on and reboot to the home screen, which will look like the first time you turned on your phone when you bought it. At this point, all data on your Android phone has been cleared, which is consistent with the wipe function in Google Find My Device, and the problem of forgetting the Android password will no longer exist. Finally, please reset your Android phone password and save it in an important place to reduce the risk of forgetting the Android phone password. Method 7 is to seek professional help. If you've tried all of the above and your phone still won't unlock, take your phone to a phone store for a professional to check and get your Android phone to the home screen. Finally, I would like to remind you that if you set up an Android phone password, you can record your Android phone password in a safe place at home, or set an easy to remember, meaningful password. That's all for today's video. If you think this video is helpful to you and think we did a good job, please like, share and tell us which method helped you solve the problem in the comment area. At the same time, if you think there is room for improvement, you can also express your views and suggestions in the message area. Thanks. Good luck.